I often get called an Oreo for being black and playing cello. As in, Oreo meaning black on the outside and white on the inside. Playing the cello is seen as a really posh thing, with the word posh being something related to just white people. Sometimes I get called black and knees because playing an instrument is seen as an Asian thing. Yet, when I'm at Nando's and I'm eating chicken with my hands, I'm now called purple or blick which are connotations for extremely black. That infuriates me. How can you define a race based on a certain mannerism or a certain talent? There isn't a set of rules or laws you should follow to become a certain race. Racism in football is a big issue. There have been countless times where I've had monkey noises made at me because I've scored a goal. There have been times where it's gotten too much and I've lost my temper and walked off the pitch. I've been to football matches where I've heard racial slurs and every time the excuse is always, oh, it's all in the heat of the moment. It doesn't give you an excuse to be racist like that. It takes thinking to come up with disgusting comments like that. Getting stopped by the police is a common problem for me. I tend to wear tracksuits because I like the fashion, but in the eyes of the media, it's seen as a gang culture item. I look like someone they're looking for, or they want to search me for drugs and weapons. Police have stopped me whilst I was driving under the assumption that I don't have insurance. My dad always told me never to react. It gives them an excuse to arrest you. And once they arrest you, you get a criminal record and that's it. Being black and having a criminal record gives you no chance competing in the working world. I hate the fact that the media puts ethnic minorities in such a bad light. I love my culture and I'm proud of where I've come from. <laughs>